I am a teacher. One of my students is failing. His name is David. David, I have some bad news concerning your grades. Oh, that doesn't sound good. What's going on with my grades? You will fail this class if you continue doing poorly in your tests. Oh no, I don't want to fail this class. Can you tell me more about what I'm doing wrong and how I can improve my grades? Talk to ChatGPT. There is a plugin where you can use audio to text to speak to ChatGPT and it will talk back to you. If you are a teacher, you can use it to practice for an interview or you can teach your students to practice their English by having conversations with ChatGPT. Let me show you how. Google talk to ChatGPT. Install the plugin. Then go to ChatGPT, log in. In the corner, you will see Talk to ChatGPT. This is where you mute yourself, where you can mute the audio or you can skip. You can change some of the settings like the voice. You can change this talking speed and the speech recognition. I am a teacher going to an interview. Give me a question based on classroom management. Here's a potential interview question related to classroom management. How do you handle disruptive behavior in the classroom? And what strategies do you use to ensure that all students are able to learn in a safe and productive environment? If there is any disruptive behavior in my classroom, I make the bad students do squats. 100 squats for every bad thing they do. I understand that you may have your own approach to classroom management, but it's important to note that physical punishment, such as making students do squats for misbehavior, is not an effective or appropriate strategy for managing a classroom. It's also not in line with ethical and legal standards for teaching. Instead, I would recommend focusing on positive reinforcement strategies such as praise, recognition, and rewards for good behavior, as well as implementing clear expectations and consequences for misbehavior. Can you give me a better answer to use in the interview? Of course. Here's a sample answer you could use for the interview question I provided earlier. You can also practice difficult conversations with ChatGPT. I am a teacher. One of my students is failing. His name is David. Can we have a dialogue? You are David and I am the teacher. Got it. I'm ready to start whenever you are. David, can you come and sit here? Sure. MS slash MR. Teacher's name. What's up? David, I have some bad news concerning your grades. Oh, that doesn't sound good. What's going on with my grades? You will fail this class if you continue doing poorly in your tests. Oh no, I don't want to fail this class. Can you tell me more about what I'm doing wrong and how I can improve my grades? You can also teach your students how to use this ChatGPT talk function to practice for English class. They can practice dialogues or they can practice for tests or specific grammar points. I am an English learner. Can we have a conversation in a restaurant and you are the waiter? Of course. Let's have a conversation in a restaurant. I'll play the role of the waiter. Can I have the menu, please? Of course. Here's our menu. Would you like a few minutes to look it over? Or do you know what you'd like to order? What do you have to drink? We have a variety of drinks available, including soft drinks, iced tea. We also have coffee and tea. How much for the coffee? Our coffee is $3 per cup, and we offer free refills on coffee. Yes, I'd like a coffee, please. Certainly. Would you like cream and sugar with your coffee? Or would you prefer it black? Sugar, please. Great. One coffee with sugar coming right up.